So this is the material that I would like to use and turn it into a drawstring or a beach dress. So I just want to quickly show you the plan. Uh, so this is the material, lay it flat, fold it into half, and then cut it. And then the other half, fold it into half again, and then cut it. So the bigger part will serve as the back piece of the dress, and then the two smaller pieces will be the front uh, bits. So when you've cut all of them, lay the flat uh, lay flat the back piece of the dress on the wrong side and then put the two front pieces on the top also on the wrong sides and then you just have to sew the two the the, the shoulder parts and the measurement of the neck part it depends on how you want it and how wide or how small you wanted it to be and then for the armhole i've decided that um, the length is 13 inches so you make a marking of the 13 inches on both sides for me i just pinned it and then from the armhole i've allocated um, i've sewn the sides as well and uh, i've only sewn it up to 18 inches and left half of it um, for because I wanted those side slits and then two inches below the armhole is my waistline and from there I've decided to put uh, the casing for the drawstring the casing for the drawstring I've um, measured later on but basically what i've done is um um is basically just count the, from the shoulder to the ankle and then i could actually cut at least six inches um so i took out the six inches and which which served as the casing for the drawstring um and the, and the other half of that became the drawstring itself you can also use other things like a ribbon if you want to. So lay everything flat and ensure that all sides are even. Um, the material that I'm using is quite easy to use because it has lines. So basically I decided to just follow the lines. I wanted to leave the sides raw so I'm not going to sew the sides. I, I kind of like it this way and plus it's easier to use so once um, all the sides are even you fold the material in half and then just cut, uh, cut uh, through it all the way It may seem weird the way I'm cutting it like this, but it's only because it's easier for me to follow the line. The material has like invisible transparent stripes. You'll see probably later on when I make the finished product. So you just cut all the way through. once that's done you take the other half of the textile and then again fold it in half and then cut all the way through sorry about the noise So once that's done, just uh, try to measure how uh, the space for your neck and see, it depends actually on how wide or, 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 or short or small the, the 
size that you want for the neck area and then you'll do exactly the same for the armhole this changes depends on how open you want the armhole to be and then from there you just sew all the sides um so actually it's quite easy so you just have to sew the two uh, two sides for the neck piece and then the two side slits and then you just have to sew the casing and the drawstring and then that's it now you do the same on the side slits you can sew all the way if you don't want the side slits but i want the size of this it's easier to move and it's kind of sexy somehow so now once you've sewn all the sides it's time to put the casing i've measured from the shoulder to the waist it's uh, 15 inches and that's where my casing is going to be so I'm just using this ruler because I wanted to make sure that the casing is in place so I'm measuring 15 15 15 all the way until the reach I reach the end of the dress So this is how it should be with the casing inside. So I have a hidden casing as you can see. And then you just have to sew it the upper part and the lower part. And then there you have it. It's this dress is really easy. Once that is done just insert the drawstring unfortunately i didn't manage to make a video of when i was making the drawstring but it's easy you just uh, sew the other side turn it in the other the other way around and then um that's it really so this is its drawstring and then you just insert it on the casing and then you have a drawstring or a beach dress this is the finished product. It's that easy. You can also make it um, more discreet, the dress, by putting some hook and eyes if you want to. Or you can just leave it like this. I'll probably put some hook and eyes. Goodbye.